Selena Gomez is living her best post-treatment life and was spotted out in Malibu Hills, plus Hailey Bieber is sparking bun in the oven rumors with her latest Instagram post. Oh Lord, plus Offset's jump off Summer Bunny is now taking back her public apology to Cardi B. Oh, grrr. and finally, Travis Scott spills all the proposal tea on Kylie Jenner. We've got all this coming at you right now on Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. <laughs> Hey everyone, I'm Lauren Ashley Beck. And I'm Courtney Revolution. And we are gonna get into all the tea on today's Daily Rewind. Okay. Selena Gomez, that's how we're starting it off. Okay. She is really out here living her best life, getting into all the things post rehab. We just saw Selena hitting the slopes with her gal pals. Did you see that picture, Courtney? I did. She is out here though. I was living, you know what I mean? It's good to see Selena Gomez. She's out and about, she's looking happy and healthy. She and got a hot. smile on that face. Three yes. inches. Hot, hot in the mountains. Healthy and hot. Okay. Warming up those mountains right I'm now. Um, so also, she was wearing a white sports bra, showing off her little midriff. Mm -hmm. She looks the bomb. I loved Snap, it. Snap, snapback game is is right. So okay. right, yes. People are always commenting about her weight, but look at these photos. Selena is out here slaying us with that body, yaddy, yaddy. And speaking of Jaylee, Jelena, we're talking about some Jaylee news right oh. now. Some are saying Haley is back on the gram because Selena is also back on the gram. Mm. What I do you don't think. think about so. that? I don't think so. You don't think so? I don't so? think so. I think that Haley was just out here reminding us. Are you talking about that picture of her? Yes, the yes, baby picture? yes. The baby picture of her and her mom. She was having a little moment. Why I think so she too. She a cute moment without it being Selena related. I agree. And it's the holidays. You're going to go through old family photos. You're going to post your things, do your thing. I don't think exactly. Selena has anything to do with it. Mm -hmm. However, okay. fans are all up in the comments sparking pregnancy rumors. Do you think she's pregnant? I, I don't think she's pregnant. Me either. I don't, I don't think she's pregnant. I don't think she's pregnant. I think people should relax. And at this particular point, let's enjoy our holiday and let the Jelenas and the Biebers <laughs> just coexist in harmony. I agree. Okay. I definitely agree. They are saying, though, that if she isn't pregnant by now, mm -hmm. she will be pregnant in 2019. Well, they moved very quick. They did. They really did. They're just rushing her whole life right now. Okay, we're going to have to keep our eyeballs rolled on that. Speaking of pregnancies, Summer Bunny has sparked some pregnancy rumors, publicly announcing Offset as her ba baby daddy. What do you think about that? Listen, Summer Bunny, we are tired of you, this name. We are tired of this story. I need her to hit the slopes and call it a day. <laughs> Okay. So she is actually saying that tearful apology that, oh my God, I'm so sorry, Cardi. I slept with your man. Crocodile tears, right? goodbye. We don't, we don't feel it. Mm -mm. She's taking that apology back. Why? For what? She she just feels like she hasn't gotten any support from the industry. She feels like people aren't really understanding her her bit, and she feels like she's been completely misunderstood. Okay, here's the thing, Lauren Ashley. Whether we appreciate them as a couple or not, Cardi and Offset were the couple of the year. Now you are the mistress coming on into the home and breaking up the home. Of course you ain't gonna get no support. We supposed to pat you on the back, Summer Bunny? <laughs> <laughs> I, and that's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, what did she want people to say? It's okay. It's okay. You're doing the right thing. We support you. We support your decisions. I just, I'm just confused. She needs to go back and reevaluate her tear ducts and give us a real apology and not take it back if she wants our sympathy because she certainly don't have any from me. That part right okay. there. All right. So Cardi also revealed her latest bop on Instagram. Did you hear it? Press, 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 press. Cardi don't need more press. I heard it. It's really good. I listened to my, I listened with my little ears. Okay. I heard what she was cooking up in the studio, I'm gonna say this. I saw her dancing. I think it would have been a great time and moment for Cardi to show that she was tippity tip typing on a keypad, riggedy rip writing <laughs> on a notepad. These are things that I okay, personally- Okay, but maybe sis wrote it. Like she I'm just not see... saying she didn't. I'm just saying at this particular point in Cardi's career, she's rising and rising and rising. I'm Fair. sure she's gonna release more music, more collections of music. I just wanna see her write it. I just want to see it. So you want her to post a literal post of her yes. just sitting there writing down each and every bar. Shut us up. Shut us up. You want to shut us up? Show the proof. I want to see her writing a mother goose story. Make it rhyme. <laughs> okay, Cardi, listen, I believe in you. I know you write some of your raps. So yes, Courtney Revolution wants to see it. I would love to see it too. Let curiosity kill the cat. Right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Moving right along, we're talking all things Travis and Kylie. Travis Scott got really candid with Rolling Stone about love for his baby mama, Kylie Jenner. I loved we, it. Yeah, I love it. I, I love this love. They're just almost the couple, they're the couple of the year now. Uh, they're up there. They're which up is, there for me. surprising. 
It surprised me. I didn't think that. I didn't even like Travis Scott before he started dating Kylie right. because I wasn't interested or invested. But now that I'm reading his interviews and seeing him up there on the Ellen, now I like him. Yes. He's more of a human. Maybe he's not a robot man. Right. He's he's alive and well. Mm -hmm. Travis revealed that Baby Stormy was conceived only three weeks after they met, mm. but he quickly realized, and I quote, it got to the point where I was like, I need Kylie with me to operate. She's mm. that one. And she is the one. Yeah. You can tell that they just have this strong bond that isn't going to be broken by any photos or anything like that. It's very genuine. <laughs> Definitely. Very gen I love to see the three of them together. Definitely. Kylie, Travis, Baby Stormy, Stormy on the hip. Yes, Cute at the aquarium, baby. doing their it. thing. I want to see more of that in 2019. Beautiful couples without extra characters coming in to break up the home. Characters. In terms of a proposal, though, it's definitely going to happen soon. Travis said, I just got to sturdy up. I got to propose in a fire way. Don't set Kylie on fire. Don't. Because <laughs> we're going to be right at the stables. Here's about the it. thing, though. <laughs> he has to top Kim and Kanye's. How's he going to do that? I don't know. I think we need to have another Life of Kylie grand finale. Special. I feel it. I feel it. We're putting it out there. E, make it happen, please. So when Baby Stormy hit the scene, Travis said, after a while, I was like, yo, this might be the illest thing that ever happened to me. And when Stormy was born, I was like, life is fire, bro. Call her a little fireball. Can we, can we? <laughs> <laughs> Call her a little fireball. Can we just talk about Travis's dictionary, like his, what he likes to say, fire, 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 fire. Fire, this illest. Is fire. So if it's like cold or it's been put out, that's not on Travis's radar. Just grab Stormy because she's a little fireball. <laughs> that's all you need. Stay warm. All right. So let us know what you guys think about Cardi and Summer Bunny, about Selena and Jaylee. Mm. Also, let us know what you think about Travis or what he should do as far as a proposal is concerned uh -oh. with Mama Kai. Thank you so much for tuning in, you guys. We'll catch you next time on Holly Scoots Daily Rewind. Bye, guys.